Today, as we seek the Lord together, I want to read a further portion of the prayer from Reverend Timothy Merritt that we started with yesterday. Let's continue in prayer together. Now, Lord, what shall we say to you? I am exceedingly filled with shame and trouble. My wounds are corrupt because of my foolishness. I am troubled and bowed down greatly. I go mourning all the day long. There is no soundness in my flesh, no health in my body. O Lord, all my desire is toward you, and my groaning is not hidden from you. My heart hungers and thirsts, and my strength fails me. As for the light which once shone within and comforted me, it is not satisfying any longer. Since thou hast given me the discovery of the depths of my sin, I cannot rest till it be removed and I am restored fully to thine image. Since thou hast given me to see thy holiness, I abhor myself and repent in dust and ashes. Unto thee, O Lord, do I lift up my soul, for my help can only come from thee. Remember, O Lord, thy tender mercies and thy loving kindness, for they have ever been of old. O oh, keep my soul and deliver me, for I am putting my trust in thee. Behold, thou desirest truth in the inward parts, and in the hidden parts thou shalt make me to know wisdom. Purge me, and I shall be clean. Wash me, and I shall be whiter than snow. Create in me a clean heart, O God and renew a right spirit within me. Give unto me the joys of thy great salvation and uphold me with thy free spirit. Let's continue praying and seeking the Lord together for a heart that is pure like God. Thank you. 